Bismillah and Assalamu alaikum students welcome back to another English lesson this is your um, week 7 of your home based learning for English and today we are going to be doing writing specifically khususnya we are going to write a personal web page so if you have your textbook in front of you uh, we are going to look at page 13 okay so this here is page 13 uh, you can see an example of a personal web page here we have Ahmad's web page we're going to read it first I'm going to try to make it slightly bigger because it's rather small Okay, we don't need to see Ahmad's face. We just need to read. Okay, so let's read this together. Hi there, my name's Ahmad and this is my web page. My mates and I. Mates uh, are kawan-kawan lah, my mates. Uh, biasanya, mates ni digunakan oleh orang UK. I've got loads of friends, but my best mate is Arjun. You could say best friend, best mate. Uh, and loads of you got I've got loads of also a very UK thing to say got lots of banyak but you can also use loads of I find nothing more entertaining than hanging out with him we spend almost all of our free time together and when we're not together we're always chatting on the phone or online or even playing online games Arjun is very sporty and he's crazy about badminton he plays in the school badminton team. I'm not a big sports fan, but we do other things together, like watching music videos and learning the dance moves. Arjun is a great dancer. I can't say that I'm as good as he is, but I'm improving. Uh, so if you pay attention, you will notice it uses a lot of the uh, expressions that we used in that we learned in our last class do you notice what they are things like um, what is it crazy about a big fan okay so those things please try to refresh your memory okay so this is um, last week's yes these things fond of big fan of interest in uh, these should be in your book, by the way, for those of you who did it last week. Okay, so let's continue reading. Uh, the next part is my interests. Apart from music, apart from music, selain daripada, uh, biasanya kita gunakan besides, right? So apart from is also another uh, connector, kata hubung, connector that we can use, which sounds more advanced. Apart from music, I love watching films and even going to see plays uh, plays adalah pementasan macam theater drama i'm thinking of becoming becoming an actor you see at the moment i'm working part time at a local pizza place because i want to earn money for acting classes another thing i'm fond of doing remember fond of like is drawing unlike my friends i'm quite good at it and also creative unlike my friends mania uh, tak macam kawan-kawan dia yang lain so he, he thinks he's better than his friends at drawing so this is an example of a web page a very simple web page so today what I want you to do is you guessed it you are going to do your own web page uh, and there are three ways how you can do your web page. Three over there. Three. Okay. Uh, number one, you can just do a mock web page, which I'm uh, web page. Olo olo, just in your book. Um, so you can maybe like put some pictures, pa paste some colored papers, or maybe just color it, draw it on your own, make it look like a web page and you need to write about yourself okay so we are going to um, 
a bit later, sikit lagi, we're going to look at what you need to write for your web page. But first, I'm going to explain um, how you can create your web page. So that's number one. You can just do a mock web page in your book. Uh, number two is if you can use a computer, but your internet is not that good, you can either use uh, Microsoft Word or PowerPoint to create a mock uh, web page. So mock tadi, M-O-C-K, mock. Let me just spell it in the blackboard. Mock web page. Mock tu uh, olok olok palsu. So that's uh, step number two that you can, uh, not step number two, option number two, pilihan number dua. And the last one, if you are feeling extremely creative and you feel like you have the time, you can go to this website, wix.com and either using your mobile phone or a computer, you can actually create a real website. It's going to be harder. There's a lot of things that you need to read and figure out what to do. But it is going to be a lot of fun if you can try it out. So I give you three options. Let me type them out. Uh, number one is... Oh wait, number one over here. Number one, mock web page in your book. So number two is mock web page again using um, Microsoft MS is Microsoft Microsoft Words or PowerPoint. Oops, let's give both two. Okay, and option number three is by using Wix.com. Okay, so Wix.com. using computer or mobile phone. So if you are uh, using Wix.com, uh, you are going to have to uh, register to use Wix.com, but you can use your school ID to register for Wix.com. So you don't need to have uh, another email or whatsoever. It's, it's actually not that difficult for you to register on Wix.com. Uh, the difficult thing is figuring out how to create the website. But it is difficult, but it can be a lot of fun if you're interested in that. Okay, so um, moving on. The next big question is, uh, what do you put in your web page? Mm -hmm. I'm going to look further down in the textbook. This one. Okay, let me just all right that one so here are some categories of what you can choose to write about uh, you can write about your family your mates again mates are friends maybe your pet if you have a pet or two or maybe more your school clothes what type of clothes you like to wear music your interests, minat, or your dislikes. So you don't need to include all of these, but uh, if it helps you, you know what you can do is you can write a few notes about each of these things, write a little bit, you can write a few things about your family, your mates, and then once you have made these notes, you can choose maybe three or four things here that you would like to include in your web page. Okay, so I want you to write a web page similar to this. So there are, for example, here there are two paragraphs, right? About my mates and I and my interests. So you only need to write this is a bit short, so maybe you can write uh, three things. So my mates and I, my interests, or maybe the last one is about my 
dislikes all my pets okay so choose three things to put in your website and last but not least when you are writing I want you to include the expressions that you have learned from last week so expressions like um, crazy uh, about here big fan fond of okay so you don't have to use all of them but try to use as many as you can use okay so that will be your work for today um, today how you submit your exercise is going to be slightly different uh, I'm not going to give you a link to submit your work rather tapinya I want you to just send your finished work in our telegram group so if it's in a book just take a picture of it send it in our telegram group and if you did create a website on wix.com you can provide the link in our telegram group okay so I hope that is clear and that will be all stop recording assalamualaikum